I think it's about time for a trim. I trim both of these about, I don't know, once a month. This one I think I might leave. So there's not a dominant plant in that. I guess there, there's a peperomia in the back. It's always kind of touched the lid, but I think it's starting to behave. Yeah, I think everyone's got their own little space actually. This one's this one's perfect. See I had a male pass away down here. And he's not going to waste because I have all sorts of isopods and springtails and snails and centipedes in here that no, they need that. A chitin needs to be in their diet. That's a good place to get it from. And I, uh, I found these isopods at a local lake. They were eating a decomposing tree. And I also have the, the roly-poly uh, type, the armadillo diem vulgare, a uh, local species too from somewhere else, in this one. So two different species of isopods and they're doing very good and the interesting thing is I think they've gotten smaller over time like they've kind of grown into this 8 inch by 8 inch by 8 inch cube Actually, these might be 9 I think that's why I bought them yeah really cool I've had these since uh, let's see April or May, I think, 2018. So, yeah, 19, 20, is it four years? Definitely need to go through and trim this one up. This lady actually got paired, and I haven't seen her for a very long time. She actually covered up her hole right there, so. Fingers crossed that there's babies in there, but I'm just gonna leave them. See, too many sacks get eaten, and I have a theory that they just they just wanna be left alone. So, I'll let them hatch in here, just like you would a Celadonia. You notice people don't freak out about Celadonias when they have sacks in their enclosure. Uh, same thing with these guys. They're not gonna have that many of them, and they're gonna come out in here, and they're not gonna go anywhere. I do know the main plant in this. This one is a red nerve plant, a red phytonia. And all the ferns are rabbit's foot ferns, which are a short, shorter fern. At least give them a watering tonight. <laughs> 